But like I said, well, it broke her wrist. She's been fighting. Like, she's been fighting these niggas for quite some time now. And I don't no, think she, been, she She ain't been pulling no punches, so. I, I, I didn't think she was going to have no broken she ribs she or gotta, nothing. She got to get tired of it. Oh, hey, hey it's really like what kids said earlier. He was like, shit, even rain can uh, wear down a mountain. Um, that's real shit. Mm -hmm. But after we see that she gets her wrist broken, we see that uh, apparently she Ooh, can use her lifespan shit. to <laughs> heal any part of her body. She basically like, like you know how she did with the steel beams, gave the, like, her lifespan to them. And then, like, no, I know she she's using her, like her life, the, the homies and shit. I yeah. know exactly what she's doing. Honestly, but like, I didn't think you could do that with yourself, but that I didn't, I didn't I know didn't she could do that way. for. Um, but I guess she never really just needed to. I wasn't surprised. Recently, though. I wasn't surprised. I, wasn't I was surprised only surprised that was the irritated. first time because I was like, "Damn!" Like it makes sense that she could do that, but since she's never done it before, it was like, "Oh shit, where did that come from?" Damn, that kind of makes you. That really makes me think of you even more OP than what you already were at first. Because now you can fucking re regenerate. I can't regenerate that health. Cheap. That shit is cheap. Um, That's all it is too. But it's yeah, cheap. she did that. But she going back into the fight. We see Kid get a little bit more versatile with his power when he Useful. starts using his awakened ability. Um, that uh, what's it? Oh, a sign where he can make you a magnet, basically, and have things repel and go to you. Um, bro, lost waking so stiff, bro. This nigga lost so cold. So yeah, we see him do that assign shit and. They used it in that that live comp. It's crazy because before we went into this, before we went into this fight, I said, I know, I know the only way this duo was gonna work is if Law is like the nigga in charge, and they just do like some tag team shit. But it's like Law's plan because Law's a he be on it, and then uh, Kid is gonna have to get his hits in when he can through Law's plans. Man, that's what's happening because after he did that assign shit and Law like dropped that building, I was like, oh yeah, that's that's a cool little move. That was. I was pretty smart. It's crazy because when they, after he said, after he had got upset with Kid or with Law, no, nah, with Kid, and was like, bro, you not my, I'm not your fucking opening act. And Kid was like, all right, fine, we'll switch it next time. Even at the end of the chapter, they didn't switch it. Kid still had the last mm -hmm. uh, final blow, but it was a dope fucking attack, so I thought that was pretty cool. I wasn't even tripping on that. Um, but no. Nah. So you think the you think the fight's still going? It's crazy because when it ended, one piece, bro. I I wanna I wanna one agree piece, with you. Bro. You know damn well. Okay, boom. I want you to tell me the last two or three fights before Big Mom and um and these two. And if you can't think of none right now, I'm gonna just throw something at you. Zoro. Yeah, Zoro and then uh, Sanji. Sanji and Queen. Ended. The very the, those the very last two those fights specifically, we for sure all thought that was gonna keep going. Honestly, I was a little disappointed that Sanji fight ended so soon. That was kind of a bro. And I low-key wanted the King fight to go a little longer just because it was so good. Um but shit, that Jinbei fight, I didn't even get none of it. What the hell? Were we ever gonna talk about it? No, they never fucking did. That's what I'm that's what I'm Jinbei saying. Whooped his ass. This I'm talking, yeah, but they was they was talking about some talking about, about some shit. important shit about I think it was shanks about, and the uh, fruit. They were talking, yeah, they were talking about the fruit, and then after the that, things, fruits awakening. That was, that's, I think that was they were saying that. something about and it. But it was after a discussion. that, Jean Bay punched the shit out that nigga. That's literally how the fight ended. They said something about it. He yeah. attacked. He got stolen off on. Cause that was they, they. The last time they touched on it was the same episode they did the the referee. Bro. Like I'm saying, I mean, um, it's a bunch of fights. This this whole arc that have ended really quickly. And I wouldn't be surprised well, if this fight was over. King fight. King King fight. King. That's the exception. But honestly, that hoe wasn't as long as it should have been. I'm with, I'm, I that hoe should have been a little longer too, because people was like, "Damn, that's it." I mean, yeah, but at the same time, brother, the, the main thing, thing is the two episodes, emperors. Like animated. That's it. I think the, the of course, big one fight gonna be a couple episodes. They can't fight. That's just not gonna be a couple episodes. Um, but no, I was cool. It was, it was a good fight, the King and Luffy fight. I mean, the King and Zoro fight. I was cool with it. Would I have liked, shit, one more chapter? Even six panels? Yeah. But I mean, it was a cool length. But I know a lot of other people wanted more just because, see, we've been waiting for this fight since we got to Wano. Um, but no, I, I think free. that, I mean, we just like the show. I think that this nigga Law, is definitely one of the coolest characters in the show. 